The boy been solid when you ask about your Mac and hard. Always on the line in the trenches like a nose guard. Never been a sucker, man. My knuckle game crazy. Leave your eye like a raccoon, punching them out like the baby. They say he a G and he know for keeping it 100. Dirt on my boots, not my name. He's so 100. When you start rapping like that, hit his area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'ma tell you what happened. He got smoked. You dig what I'm saying? Like, so at the end of the day, you was gonna be. I got more fans in Philly than you. Man, get the fuck out of here. What are you talking about, bro? That shit sounds good. I have more fans. I have more fans in Philadelphia than crazy. you. That's what are you talking about? Boo. Nah, nah, nah. What? Oh, nah. Uh oh. Bruh. Bruh, 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 bruh. You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers and notification gang, etc., etc. Let's just get right into this, man. Yo, did y'all see Easy to Block Captain and Hitman Hollis face off? Remy Ma, Jay Black, salute to all of them. Put this face off together, bruh. I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna go out on a limb. I don't really go out on a limb too often, but I'm gonna just say this. I now feel like, and I feel like, Easy to Block Captain versus Hitman Hollow is the most important battle for 2023 thus far. And Ill Will versus Hollow to Don, phenomenal battle. Way, way, way up there. Great. That's the second most, or they could be 1A, 1B. The reason why I say this is before I saw the face off, or before I seen how this was gonna happen, I thought it would be a great battle. You know what I'm I never thought it was gonna be a great battle, but this is going to be epic. Reason why. There's a number of reasons, right? When they're going back and forth with each other, and Easy the Block Captain is saying his accomplishments, he's 12 and 0 on the app, he's the hottest new nigga ever. You know, he, he's been doing his thing. Uh, he's saying he smoked this person, smoked that person. I was having a conversation this morning, and some of the guys in the conversation was like, Easy the Black Captain has won. While he has won, he's not 3-0 in every single one of these people. And one of the comments was, he only really smoked Cortez and Big T. The rest are wins, but no, he's not body and body and body. While I don't agree, I believe there's other people that I feel like he clearly beat. I feel like he clearly beat Goods. I feel like he clearly beat Rex. I feel like he clearly beat... I can just go up and down. T I can go all up and down the resume of battles that I felt like he's clearly won. Now, has, and Chess, that was a crazy battle. That was one of the best, best battles I've seen in the last couple years. Now, when people say Hitman is his biggest competition, it's the truth. Hitman brings millions and millions and millions of views. He's on Wild and Out every day. Everything that, like what Easy was saying, like, you know, he's on TV. Hitman been on TV 12 years. You know, Easy started uh, a couple years ago. Hitman been doing this since 2013. Like, and the thing is, like, uh, when I saw Hitman say, when, when Easy was comparing the stage and saying that he did 2,500, Hitman's like, I did 3,500, I did 3,700. He's like, the venues that you sell out, I would have sold out in 2010. And here's the biggest reason why the battle is probably, you can agree, you can disagree, the biggest battle of 2023 thus far, because I feel like First of all, somebody's got to lose. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's not going to be a winner. I mean, everybody, I mean, it, it could be the craziest debatable ever, like another easy versus chess where we don't care who won and woo de woo. But I feel like there's going to be a winner in this. The reason why is because their styles vary. Hitman admitted that he don't rap about, you know, the drugs, the, the, the shit, that, that's his uphill battle. Hitman's uphill battle is battling the narratives and battling the fact that he's not rapping about street shit and drugs and this, that, and plugs and... The shit that Easy be rapping about. Easy is literally got himself to Hitman quicker than anybody else really would nowadays, and he's on a crash course because the thing is, if he beats Hitman, he solidifies himself. Like, if he, I feel like he's top tier already. He made his own top tier. He's had a bunch of top tier battles. He's went from nobody to top tier in a very fast um, run. Uh, if he beats a Hitman, regardless of the league, see. 
When it said this league versus that league versus this league versus that league don't count, that's not the same notion anymore because it is a YouTube release. Easy to block captain will do his first million views on YouTube, not on URL. Like, his first million view battle will not be on URL. Do you think they like that? I know the answer is no. But they could have had a million view battle with Easy on the YouTube by now. But they're not concerned with YouTube. But see, the thing is, here's the problem. When you think about the general public, a majority of the general public does not have the URL app. And then in the app, like with the releases, you'll see most of the comments is, I just got the app back recently. You know what I'm saying? And I'm probably, I probably, I don't know. Yeah, I might have it, I might not. But most of the comments that people be saying is, fuck this app, they not releasing shit. Like they killing y'all and y'all own. Do y'all not read it? Are y'all... Are you niggas not reading your own fucking comments, bro? Like, do y'all not read y'all comments? Do y'all not know what's going on? I flipped the shit all out the way. Do y'all not know what's going on on your own app? Do y'all not see? Like, Easy was literally in a press conference saying, fuck that app. It is what it is. I, I have no reason to sit up here and play with y'all today. But uh, what I was going to say is the reason why Hitman is in a position as to where he can end all of this easy to block captain notion, all of this talk about him, he can end it all in one day. The reason why I feel like easy to block captain is gonna do well, he's gonna, this is what he does. In every single one of his battles, he's shown up and he's delivered the goods, like even against goods, but he's delivered at the highest level. Hitman Holla is going to be able to bring, he's gonna bring smoke. This will be to me, I think one of Easy's challenges, you know what I'm saying? Like a lot of the battles that he has, while he wins, and wins at a high level, and he's always prepared, and he's always got material, he's always gonna have some kind of, I go bodies at the body when the coach starts shape shifting, like he, 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 he's gonna bring that level of pain to Hitman. Now, what is Hitman gonna combat that shit with? We can go through all of the layers of, of lyrics and lyricism and things like that, but I just think that after this face off, their battle went from about a seven, eight as an interest, like people really like oh, we'll to a ten. Period. This is much. This is now turned into must see TV. Like you must. Like I must see Easy to Black Captain versus Hitman, whether there or at home. I'm starting to personally lean towards home because uh, while I love New York and I love you know what I'm saying live events and shit like that, the, the 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 capturing that moment, encapsulating it, remembering it, being able to rewind it, break down bars. For me personally, it's more worth it watching it at the crib so I can rewatch it, get footage, break down bars and shit like that. If I'm there, which is great too, I swear I will watch a battle, be around all the smoke, all the drink, go outside and forget the whole shit. Like I will literally be headed to my car and forget the whole battle. And I've done it. I went to like I've been at the last three joints. I was at Rock's event. I went to RBE's joint. I was at uh, Battle Academy. So we're not doing this scared to go outside shit. I've been outside all year. But what I will say is this, when you leave those events, when you're listening, you can't, I can't remember none of the material because it's just, you just take it in. So for me personally, I feel like this battle is so crazy between these two that I went from, you know, I want to go, I want to be here, to now I need to digest this. I might need to sit down and actually watch this with my feet kicked up with no outside interaction because I feel like this is the most important battle of 2023 thus far. Most important. This is a big... This right here, you heard what Hitman said? Easy to block Captain beats Hitman Holler. That title alone on a blog or on the online, or and that title alone is crazy. If he beats him, his career will never be the same. It's only up. Hitman's one of those people that you aspire to battle. Like that's the goal, that's an end game for most. Easy's doing it in his, Third year, second year on URL, big as a big star. I think this is a big opportunity. Do I think that he delivers? I think he's a black captain will deliver. I do think this is going to be a phenomenal battle. Um, now, do I feel like Hitman is overconfident? No, I do feel like he's confident in his ability to be. In. See, the thing is, easy to black captain hasn't battled in front of the Irving Plaza crowds, the Stage Forty Eight crowds, the 
Webster Hall. He has not battled in front of them crowds, but he did battle with Chess in front of 2,500 people and shook the fucking building. This is going to be a war. I promise you. I don't see nothing less than five stars war of big capacity. A hitman is a battler who has been known to go first. Like, he don't mind going first. I know Easy was saying that he would rather a uh, hitman go first, but he's prepared to go first. I did think that that was well. And I did like the fact that the face-off had a little smoke in it. Face-offs are good with smoke. I don't want to see anybody, like when you're sitting across the table from each other, it's like, I respect what you do. I'm just here because I got to be here, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not going to disrespect you. I'm here, you know what I'm saying? I just want to have a good battle, you know what I'm saying? Nah, man, I like it when they get each other's face. And you ain't done this, and you ain't done that, and I can't wait. I'm going to see you on the 25th. I'm going to see you on the 25th. Um, But I will say that the, 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 the temperature got turned up from 300 to 400 degrees in a heartbeat. Um, there's some other great battles on the card, but I think that uh, even without the face-off or the press conference, this battle would have been sold, but I feel like it's extra sold now. Like, niggas just like, yo, all right, what are we doing next week? All right, you got this, you got that. You gonna be bringing this, we gonna bring, and they gonna have parties everywhere. Um, I must salute and congratulate Remy Ma for putting this together, uh, un being unwavering, you know what I'm saying? Cause I heard, I heard what I heard. I heard a lot behind the scenes about this battle potentially be trying to be blocked or trying to not happen. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't, like I said, I don't work for no league. I don't ever want to. Been down those roads before and I know what they lead to. If you're not compromised or you're not gonna understand and agree to everything that we got going on or get up under the wing, it ain't gonna be your thing. So for me, I like it from this level. I can talk about whatever the fuck I want. My phone never gonna ring. Nobody gonna tell me what I can't say versus what I can't because uh, that's, it's just not going like that. But salute to Remy Ma, salute to the Bronx. You know how Bronx niggas do. I'm not surprised. Uh, I'm very, very, very excited and happy to see what you got going on. And the fans and everyone is waiting. I do feel, again, this is the most, most important battle of 2023 because I feel like the tide shifts. If Easy beats Hitman, he takes that whole era and brings it with him. This is your leader. I got him under the wing and I beat him. If Hitman, Beats easy, he resets everything, and then he goes off like, like Thanos. Yeah. They say the boy been solid When you ask about your Mac and hard Always on the line In the trenches like a nose guard Never been a sucker Man, my knuckle game crazy Leave your eye like a raccoon Punching them out like the baby They say he a G And he know for keeping it 100 Dirt on my boots, not my name